Yo, 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 it's your boy Leo coming at you from the Bone Knocks. Not really. We're gonna be checking out another Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged episode 14 when Yami met Sally. So let's check this shit out. You're watching Yu-Gi-Oh! When you could be outside doing something else. Finally, fresh air. <laughs> I love Honestly. the smell of card games in the morning. Look, guys, we're right outside Pegasus's castle. Now we just gotta win the prize money, and then I can buy some new friends. What about oh, your sister, Joey? <laughs> yeah, I can buy a new sister, too. I'm glad the car was gay, otherwise, we never would have gotten out of that cave. Oh, so you gotta buy some new friends, you gotta buy a new sister, gotta buy a new life. Man, he, he got some big, he got some big goals there. Hey, Taya, remember the time we became friends? No, but I do remember the 4Kids version. Welcome to Kentucky Fried McBurger King, where all our meat is freshly slaughtered. Oh, shoot, it's those dorks from school. They'll drive away our customers with all that talk of card games. <laughs> I've got to do something. Hey, yeah, you, that's the problem you know here. Call a quarter pounder in France? A Royale with cheese. It's all because of the metric system. I wonder what they call the super special awesome burger. Kiss my grits, you geeks. Holy cow, I think I'm in love. I don't want to be just a waitress my whole life, you know. I'm saving up my money to become a table dancer in New York. Hey, that's where All my right. accent used to live. The next day, I found a suspicious note in my locker. Dear Taya, we found you a secret dance studio. Please come at once. P.S. Bring lots of money so that I can steal it from you. Well, this is just about the worst dance studio ever. Are you my dance instructor? Just hand over your money, girlie. P.S. Bring, bring a lot of money so I can steal it from you. But fortunately, I can still it. What? All right. I'm here my ballet classes. I should warn you, I look damn good in a tutu. Get lost. I'm trying to mug this girl. You won't like me when I'm angry. Hulk smash. When I woke up, I was staring at the man of my dreams. Hey, sweet cheeks, you want to get off the dance floor? I'm about to shake my moneymaker. And then we got married <laughs> and had two beautiful children. I'm pretty sure I don't remember that part. Hey, Taya, do you still have that waitress uniform? Hey, stop developing your characters. We have card games to play. Look, everyone, some random losers. Stop developing your characters. Since you beat me in that first episode, you got more important things to do. been able to take me seriously. Seriously, but that will all change once I defeat you in a children's card game. That Kaiba bloke needs to get shagged. I have to beat Yugi if I ever want to see my little brother again. I miss you, Mokuba. Kidnapping number one. Kidnapping number two. <laughs> number, <laughs> number 46. Number 83. <laughs> Jesus. Perhaps I should consider keeping him on a leash. I accept yeah, your challenge. I think you should. Kyber. Kicking your butt never gets old. Let's play on the roof as an homage to clerks. We'll use my new dual disc system because I have a hard on for technology. Don't worry, you. We'll be supporting you all the way. Ten bucks on Kyber. Fifty bucks on Kyber. <laughs> Hundred quid on Kaiba. I'd won ten star chips in America. My hair is inviting you to enter the castle. Don't mind if I do. Man, that guy sure likes talking about his hair. Man, that guy sure likes talking about America. You may have beaten me before. <laughs> well, the but irony. This time, I have the upper hand. I've placed my faith in the heart of the cards, and without Exodia, you have no chance of overcoming my unstoppable blue eyes white dragons. Yeah, well, at least I'm not adopted. What oh, did shit. You just say? <laughs> Sorry, did I touch a nerve? Why don't you run home and cry to mummy? Oh, that's right. You don't have one. Yugi, I respect you as a duelist, but if you continue to act like a petulant child, then... Hey, everybody, look at me. I'm Seto Kaiba. I have a dragon fetish, and I sound like Brock from Pokemon. Screw the rules. I'm in love with Nurse Joy. That's it, Moto. You're f***ing dead. With this card, I'll be able to combine three of my blue-eyes white dragons in order to summon a monster without peer. A monster so powerful that... For the love of Ra, just play the damn card already. Fine. Come forth. Yo, Yami's just not taking any of that bullshit. Poopy. 
get up on the Hydra's back, Yug. I activate asexual reproduction. Oh, Prepare God. to be completely smothered by my giant hairy balls. <laughs> this is almost as exciting as my favorite movie. Uh, I like that. That was good. Bastards got what was coming to them in America. I shall fuse my mammoth graveyard with your dragon, causing it to decay from the inside. How the hell did you do that? It's called cheating. Deal with it. I'd rather die than lose to my arch rival. Oh my! If you get tax, the shockwaves could send Kaiba flying right off the edge of the castle. Your gay friend is right, Yugi. I'm not gay. I'm just British. Dude, don't you think you're overreacting a little? I mean, it's just a card game. Card games are <laughs> serious business. Now unleash your attack if you have the guts. This is awesome. Yugi's gonna kill Kaiba. I've always dreamed this moment would come. Kaiba must die. But what would Grandpa say? Yugi. Do it, motherfucker. That son of a bitch. <laughs> Take this risk. I told you. I told you. She's right. We can't. Stop. I don't believe it. Yugi forfeited the match to Kaiba. Ben Affleck would be ashamed. In America, what? I knew my emo strategy would pay off. You geeks are so gullible. I lost a card game. I no longer have a reason to live. In that case, can I be the main character? Hell no. Bugger. <laughs> Trying to take advantage of the situation. I see. Oh, I know there's like a mid credit scene or some shit. Less super special awesome burger. Alright, the more you know. But yeah, uh, overall this was pretty good. It started kind of slowly at the beginning. But then... Like as the episode went on, it got better and better. So a lot of a lot of a lot of respect to that, especially that whole compilation of how many times Smokuba gets kidnapped, which is fucking true, by the way. Uh, anyways, which is fucking true, by the way. All the fucking time it happens. You gotta keep that kid on a leash or just fucking end them, <laughs> end them yourself. All right, just finish the job. All right, put put good old Yeller out if you have to. But anyway, guys, any comments, any suggestions, you guys let me know down in the comment section down below. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, definitely give this video a like, subscribe, and share. But besides that, this is your boy Leo signing out. Deuces.